Good day golfers. Today we find ourselves on the putting green. We are focused purely now on long distance putts and focusing on getting the distance control right with the long distance putts. I really hope that our videos have educated you well and that's helped you with many things that's bothering you with your golf game. And if you have any questions, please feel free to <coughs> drop us a message on our YouTube channel, comment on the videos. You're more than welcome to get into contact with us and we'll gladly discuss and also uh, talk about any questions you have regarding the game of golf. Now this specific exercise purely focuses on getting long putts close to the hole but guaranteeing a two putt. This is where I find a lot of amateur players throw a lot of shots away. The minute they start getting further away from the hole they start three putting and four putting and this throws away a lot of shots. Now as you've seen I've packed a couple of tees around the hole they're about all three foot away from the hole which makes a perfect circle around the hole and if I refer back to one of my earlier videos where we focus purely on short putts if you've got the confidence with that short putt draw that I've discussed with you uh, in the previous edition this exercise will make so much sense because if you can get the ball inside that three foot circle due to the fact that you've got confidence with the way that you're knocking those short little putts in you can get the ball in that radius you've got a 90% chance of walking over the two putt and not three or four putting. So we're now exactly 10 meters away from the hole. This is a sort of putt that sort of starts downhill, goes back up to the hole with a bit of right to left break. And my goal here is actually now very interesting. I'm not gonna focus on the hole. I'm just gonna focus on that circle around the hole. And when I take my practice strokes, looking at that circle, all I wanna try and feel is it just how hard I should hit the ball to get the ball inside that circle. So I'm not worried if the ball is short of the hole, left of the hole, right of the hole, or even past the hole. Just get the ball inside that circle. Now a very interesting question, a lot of, uh, a lot of my students ask me, Johan, why do the professionals sink so many long putts? And the interesting thing is I say, okay, look at the leaderboard at the end of the week. The player that generally makes the most amount of feet gained in putts made during the tournament tends to win it. And that player that week tends to make a bit more longer putts than the other players. And the reason for that is, is because he's got the speed dialed in perfectly for the greens that week. And why this is important is, I've noticed that so many players, when doing this exercise, they come to me afterwards and they say, oh, but hang on a sec, I'm now actually starting to make more long putts. And the reason for this is because you're not putting all your focus on the hole itself. You're just focusing on getting the right speed, the right distance control and get the ball inside that circle. So let's hit a couple of putts and see how it goes. So I've got the line. There's my practice stroke. Let's see the first one. Okay, great. I could hit the back tee. Maybe a little bit too hard, but they would have finished inside that circle that I've created for myself. Now, as you know by now, I like playing little games against myself and I like to challenge myself and all the viewers out there. And what you should do here is, let's say you choose four, five, six balls, no matter how many balls you choose, you're only allowed to go two putt the ball if it finishes inside that circle. So if it finishes outside the circle, you're not allowed to go try and two putt it. So you've got to try and see how many of the balls that you start with here, you can first of all get inside that circle. And then second of all, you must now knock it in from there and see if you can walk over the two putt. And that's again a little game you can play against yourself. It makes you focus, it makes you concentrate, not just standing here hitting putts. So, as I said, try and get as many balls inside that circle. If you get all of them in, job done, uh, step one, job done, well done. Second part, now you've got to go and try and two putt them. And you're going to see, okay, how many balls can I get inside that circle and how many of those balls can I walk away with a two putt. This is a fantastic and probably one of the best long distance control uh, or distance control drills I know for putting. And as I said, we're looking at two aspects here. Get the ball inside that circle that you've created with your tees. And from there then, let's see if you can two putt it. Please don't forget to subscribe and like our videos and comment at the bottom. Happy golfing to all of you out there.